If you're watching this, my dad was probably your hero. He was mine. He was a great firefighter. But an even better captain. He brought the best out of everyone by demanding nothing less. He was a natural leader, as anyone who has ever worked with him knows. He built great firefighters, future captains, maybe even future chiefs. But beyond that, he was the best father he could be. And that wasn't easy to do, especially on his own. My dad was faced with some pretty terrible choices when I was a kid. But he did what he thought was best for me at the time. Every time. He chose to protect me above all else. And while he may have made mistakes, I have no doubt he'd make them all again if he thought it was best for me. It wasn't easy growing up without my mom um, and without siblings. But what I've come to realize is my dad did his best to give me family. He created a home at Station 19, and everyone under his roof was his kid. <laughs> so he may have spent years protecting me from pain and burying his own, but he did his best to give me the gift of a group of people who I feel closer to than any blood brother or sister. He did his best. He did his best by me. He loved me. He stayed. He stayed with me every minute he could until he had to leave me to save me one last time. I didn't believe you. I told you you were crazy. Well, in fairness to you, I was acting crazy. Are you okay? Yes and no. I, I guess uh, knowing the truth is better than wondering. But again, I'm I'm sorry. I wasn't here for no, you. No, no. I took morphine when I woke up. I needed it. But no, I'm afraid. I'm afraid it's going to make me crave more of it. I'm afraid I won't be able to control it. I need to focus on my recovery. I spoke to Dr. Shepard and she suggested I uh, take some space. From, from me? It's just 90 days. Just to get to the meetings, OK? Just to work the steps and get some solid recovery. You're not supposed to make any big life changes when you're in early sobriety. I knew that, and I was barely sober. And you, you were about to lose your dad. We had no business getting married. So, so you regret it? <laughs> no, no, and I never will. But if I want to stay clean, we need some time apart. Totally, totally separated. Separated, but together, if I want to stay clean. And do you? I do. I want to live a long, long life. And love you every minute of it. I love you, Dad. We all do. And if there's one thing I wish I could tell you, it's that I am grateful for you because you did your job so well.